Barnes & Noble signing in Pearland. It was pretty cool. Our book signing yesterday was canceled by Borders because they again couldn't be bothered to order the books in time, which I don't understand. Second time in a row for Borders. That's it for Borders. We're focusing on Barnes & Noble. They're very, very good to us at Barnes & Noble. They have the books on hand. They print up posters and actually post them in the store. They uh, put displays of signed author copies after we leave. And they made us the author of the month in the Austin area. That's right. And they gave us free coffee. Free coffee! Barnes & Noble rocks. Barnes & Noble rocks. With the Celtic beat. Bagpipes in the background. I love my Scotsman, my Kevin McKidd, and my beautiful husband. I'm obsessed. Of course, those of you who know me know that I'm this about me already. Currently, I'm obsessed about getting a liar. Brink, 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 brink. What do you think? He might make me a liar, but I really want a liar. I was listening to the podcast. It was called The Druid Cast. Really cool podcast. They were telling the story in the bardic tradition. That's a druid thing. So we thought we could play the harp bling, 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 while at these events like Celtic fairs and Renaissance festivals while telling the story of Rowan of the Wood. Dot com. Rowan of the Wood dot com. So there it is. Yep. Etc. 